Okay, so today what we're going to be talking about is fuel pumps. I'm going to explain the purpose of a fuel pump, how it works, and how to hook up one if you are replacing one or installing a motor that doesn't have one now. This is a V-twin Briggs and Stratton engine. You can see right up there what it is. 26 hours. Briggs. And um, this one here is on a zero turn, so it obviously has a fuel pump. This right here is a fuel pump. Um, when the tank is lower than the engine, or if the engine is higher than the tank, if you want to put it that way, or if the tank is in the rear of the mower, or if the tank is on the side, and sometimes rare occasions you'll find a tank in the front and the more have a fuel pump. Anyways, this is the fuel pump right here. That's what it looks like. It's really nothing it's simple. Alright, this line right here is coming from the fuel tank. You can see it's got the fuel filter on it. There's a hookup right here on the bottom of the fuel pump. It's the port all the way in the back of the fuel pump. And that is your inlet from the gas tank. Okay? This line right here is your output to the carburetor or outlet, outlet port. And that's going to be the one on this side of the fuel pump when you're looking at it from this way. Now, how does a fuel pump work? Well, there has to be a vacuum created to actually run the pump. So, on V-twin engines, you will primarily see the vacuum line, which is the center port right here. It will be hooked up to the valve cover. On single cylinder, uh, Briggs and Stratton, primarily you will see them hooked, the vacuum line hooked into the oil, uh, oil dipstick. And on Kohler, it'll most likely, if it's a Command or Command Pro, it'll be mounted on the side of the block. And the, it's actually a mechanical fuel pump on them, it's driven off the camshaft. But um, on most V-twin engines, you will see this style of fuel pump. Now this is a uh, Briggs & Stratton 26 horse V-twin engine, it's a pretty big motor, pretty big mower. But um, again, this is your inlet from the gas tank, this is your vacuum line or center port, this is your outlet to the carburetor. So, to carburetor, from fuel tank, vacuum. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them below. I will see you in the next video.